Whenever we're embarking on a new type of procedure, um, it takes a special type of patient to enter into this unknown with us. There's a certain amount of pride that I'm going to be the first to have this procedure. But that also has a certain amount of uh, terrifying factor to mm -hmm. it. I work as an engineer, so the, the, the pioneering spirit there really appeals to me. It's very exciting to me. Good luck. See you later. The injury happened uh, in the Cayman Islands while I was rock climbing with some friends and my daughter. I fell uh, roughly 50 feet to the ground, shattered my ankle, my wrist, my pelvis, uh, dislocated my shoulder, bruised my lungs, separated ribs from my sternum. And one small hole in my heel. Every step hurts, and I, I try. I struggle with: uh, Will I be able to live with this for the rest of my life? Could I live with this the rest of my life? Then, in the meantime, I started thinking about amputation. Jim's a pioneer. Jim's our astronaut. He's our first guy taking, for lack of a um, better term, first step onto the moon. Up until this point, there's been these great leaps in terms of technology and, and prosthetic development in particular. But we don't have the ability to connect the human body to those capabilities because our amputation model hasn't really changed in thousands of years. One of the things that we're hoping is to even the score, in a sense. Compared to a, a standard amputation, um, that in this case, uh, as things move forward, he will have more robust access to the nerves. So it will feel to him uh, as if he is controlling his physiological limb, even though it's been replaced by a robotic limb. We view this as an important first step of many to come in sort of um, revolutionizing the way that amputations are done. His name is in all the climbing guidebooks because he's done a lot of what we call first ascents, and so he's the first one to climb the route, and then they name it and they grade it. So he's, it's, it seems to just fit like right along with Jim and his accomplishments. Today I'll be taking my first steps on a prosthetic leg. You should use the bars when you start. So you, you... I have to? 